The United Nations is celebrating World Water Day on March 22, 2012. They'd like you to understand some quick facts about water, how water relates to food. A large quantity of water is needed to produce the food we eat every day, more water than most people think. What is the relationship between food production and water use? Well, on average, we drink between two and three liters of water per day, but it takes 1,500 liters of water to produce just one kilogram of grain, and 10 times that amount, 15,000 liters, to produce one kilogram of meat. To produce enough food to satisfy a person's daily needs takes about 3,000 liters of water. Water is a renewable resource, but it is finite. Water covers the earth, but 97% of that water is salt water. 1.7% is locked in ice. Less than 1% of water is fresh and available for our use. The world population, unlike water, has been continuously increasing, meaning there is less water for everyone to satisfy the needs for living a healthy life. In 2012, we are now at more than 7 billion people on the planet. As we look out to 2300, some estimates indicate that the population will continue to increase. Other predictions show population decreasing significantly and others see us getting to 9 billion people and holding steady. When we look at the total amount of water that we have available and look out to 2030, during the time when we know that the world population will be increasing, we see that domestic use of water is significant. When we add industrial use, it is more concerning. But when we look at agricultural use, we are using almost all of the available water 70% of all water use is for agriculture. The world is thirsty because it is hungry. It takes 1,000 times more water to feed the human population than it does to satisfy its thirst. Drinking, washing, eating, and producing any goods depends on water. The United Nations invites you to Italy on March 22nd for La Giornata Mondiale dell'Acqua. Dia Mundial dell'Agua, Journée Mondiale de l'Eau, World Water Day. Visit them at www.unwater.org slash worldwaterday.